I play Ian Lightfoot in the film Onward. He's kind of like a, you know, like an awkward teenager who's trying to find himself in this incredible world that Pixar have so geniusly created. Um, and it's really fun for me to bring this character to life because while yes, he is awkward and there are similarities between him and Peter Parker, they're also a world apart. Um, and this quest that him and his brother Barley go on is one that's been so fun to watch on screen and so fun to partake in as an actor. They perform this spell, which will hopefully bring their dad back for 24 hours. And like all things, Barley kind of gets in the way halfway through the process and spoils the spell. And we are left with nothing but my dad's legs. So we have to take him on this quest to find another Phoenix gem so we can bring him back for a day and I can finally meet my dad. Um, and it's a really, like, it's a heart-rending tale of two brothers getting closer together, meeting their father and, and going on a quest that they'll never forget. I mean, for me, the dream of working with Pixar was, you know, that was kind of the best part of the job. And then the fact that I got to do it with my buddy Chris was so cool. When I found out that he was going to play the role of Barley, I was super, super excited to jump back on screen with him. Um, so, yeah, so it's been a real whirlwind. And there's so many things that have been so great about the process. I've learned a lot about filmmaking. It's a very different process to anything I'm used to. Um, and uh, I'm very grateful to Pixar for giving me the opportunity. Ian's relationship to magic, he's, he's quite jaded towards it at the beginning. Like he, he, he resents it almost and, and he knows that it's something of the past. And Barley seems to have this obsession with it which really annoys Ian. And throughout the course of the movie, their friendship and their bond becomes magic. You know, and, uh, and it's really nice to just see two brothers getting along and having a good time and, and saving the day ultimately. We had one session together, which was really fun. Um, but what was so interesting is you would go in, do a session, improvise, go away, and then six months later you'd come in again and Chris had done a new session, but improvised on the stuff that you had done. So then you would improvise on the old stuff. So it was just a really cool process and it's an interesting way to work with people um, because they're not in the room and sometimes they're thousands of miles away.